What is going on everybody, my name is General Missens and welcome back to episode 7 of my Assassin's Creed series playthrough. This is Assassin's Creed 1 and we have just been promoted. As you can see here we've got a nice little chest rig and we've just assassinated our second target. And now we must head to Jerusalem to assassinate our third target. Now I'm not sure who it is, I'm, I'm thinking it's uh... Oh, I can't even think of his name at the moment, but I think he might be the archer dude But anyway So as we are running towards Jerusalem or you know running towards the horses. I just wanted to talk a little bit For a second wow, sorry about that got my throat clogged up I just wanted to talk for a second about my previous episodes um, basically <laughs> uh, I, uh, how, to, how to bloody say it what do you call it? Yeah, the information sessions have been telling us ways to basically go about assassinating our targets, and I've been doing them completely wrong. Um, the last assassination we just did, which was uh, Garnier, who's the doctor, we basically, the, the information things told us that we can use the beams to avoid, you know, the mentally ill people trying to kill us. I'm gonna pickpocket this guy because knives, please. Oh, okay. But, um, yeah, and it basically told us the best way to go about getting into our target, and it was like getting in there via scholars, or climbing, I think you can climb the building and then look in as Ganya's doing his breaking the leg thing, or whatever, but I completely did it wrong, and I failed, so this time, we shall not fail, we shall prevail. And we shall do it as we are told. Alrighty, and we are here in Jerusalem. This is the uh, the most sort of well, uh, sort of well. Oh, here we go. That is the best. That is the only way you enter Jerusalem. It's by knocking over a hundred civilians in one run. That is <laughs> that's one of my most favourite parts about this game is coming to Jerusalem because I get to do that and I get to piss off a lot of people. Wow, these uh well, there we are. Alrighty, so once again we have to find a a suitable entrance route. So I think we're going to take a little different approach and we're going to climb. As you can see, ha ah, there is a lot of pearls. You can go, or, or we can just go save him. You know what? I'm going to give this a shot. I don't think this is going to work. But I'm going to do it anyway. Um, climb, please. Oh. Hey, dude. There we go. Yes. Um, yep, good. Because I'm pretty sure you can just, like, jump across on top of this. And then just jump your way in. I have a feeling I'm going to get caught if I do that. I really don't want to do that. Should I? YOLO! Oh, that was stupid. 
I'm dropping, I'm dropping. I'm, what? Hey, we win! Okay. So, I was very worried there. But anyway, once again, we're gonna have to do a shit ton of viewpoints. Which sucks. I can already hear, uh, you can probably already hear the, um, one of the preachers down there preaching some completely off shit. So he's probably going to be our first target. But I wanted to kind of do these viewpoints all in one go. <laughs> Oops. I think I wasn't supposed to be up there. Oh well. Oh, ooh, ooh, I remember from episode 5 that we bug it up. And we did one of these things first, which we're not going to do. We're going to go to the Bureau. Because we're not going to bugger up again. Because that is a stupid mistake. We're going to do this viewpoint as well. La 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 la. Climb, climb. Climb, climb, climb. I'm actually recording this on the 1st of January, 2014. Wow. Just thought you should know. I'm actually really excited for 2014, it's my last year of school, and I think I'm going to do very well with this whole YouTube thing as well. I'm hoping that, uh, you know, I can stick to my schedule, even though I'll be at school, which I'm hoping I can do that. But anyway... Alright, that did nothing for us. Wow. Alright. Let's go to the Bureau. Really? Wow. La 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 la. La 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 la. Um. Ha. <laughs> Alright, so here's something we can use. Boom! Throwing knives for the win! That was awesome. I'm gonna do this few point two, because I may as well. Ah, shit. Ah, uh, here we go. Hey, don't call me a peasant! I will destroy you, son! Yeah, damn right. There's gonna be a guard up here, isn't there? Hey, boy. <laughs> okay, that did nothing for us either. God damn it. Oh, well. May as well. I've also just played a little bit of Freedom Cry. I haven't actually played that much. I've only just got the ship. But uh, I'm enjoying it. I really am. I was thinking of putting up a first impressions video, but I really, like, I don't think I really have the time and there's not really any point because the game's been out for a while now, so. Safety and peace, Malik. Your presence here deprives me of both. What do you want? Al Muallam has asked. Asked that you perform some menial task in an effort to redeem yourself. So be out with it. Tell me what you can about the one they call Talal. It is your duty to locate and assassinate the man, Altair, not mine. You'd do well to assist me. His death benefits the entire land. Do you deny his death benefits you as well? Such things do not concern you. Your actions very much concern me. Then don't help me. I'll find him myself. <sighs> wait, wait. It won't do having you stumble about the city like a blind man. Better you know where to begin your search. I'm listening. I can think of three places. South of here in the markets that line the border between the Muslim and Jewish districts. To the north near the mosque of this district, and east in front of St. Anne's Church, close to the Babariha Gate. Is that everything? It's enough to get you started, and more than you deserve.
Alrighty, so that was Malik, and if you remember him from episode 1, and I believe episode 2 as well, I'm pretty sure he was there. He, um, we basically screwed him over royally, which wasn't very nice, but yeah. So he's now one of the, uh, the bureau leaders, or whatever they're called, and he's not very happy that we're, um, we're asking him for help, which is, you know, it's, it's fair enough, we were kind of a dickhead. But uh, anyway, I'm going to do these assa um, assassination, fire out these viewpoints, and I will see you in a little bit. Alright, so I haven't done all the viewpoints yet. I've just got one more to find, but I just found this guy here. Uh, as you can see, he's wearing this funky yellow and black cloak, and that's one of our targets as, 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 as guards. I had trouble getting that one out. Yeah, so, oh, bugger. Oops, 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 oops. Um, look, get, run away! Fucking idiot, holy shit. Um, <laughs> alrighty, so, yeah, just wanted to point that out. Alrighty, so I've just done the last viewpoint I need to do. There's just one more that I can do, but I'm not going to. <coughs> But anyway, so we're going to start with this pickpocket mission. What the f- Piss off, dickhead. Take me on, bitch. dudes. This is one of the Templars as well. See, there we go. What a dickhead, he brought that on himself. That wasn't my fault. Oh, shit. Oh, yep. If the guard won't take action, it falls to us to do something. What you propose is madness, but necessary. How many more will we allow to go missing before the people take a stand? It does not affect us. Not yet. But if we continue to do nothing, it will. And what do you propose? I've watched the man. Learned everything there is to know about his operation. It's all here on a map I've made. He inspects his stock every day at the same time. This is when I'll strike. So you have a piece of paper. It won't save you when you're discovered. Won't shield you from their swords and arrows. If all goes well, it won't come to that. Anyway, it's a risk I'll have to take. Wish me luck, my friend. Indeed. You'll need it. Alrighty. What is so it? we're gonna wait, because he's gonna start, and then he's gonna stop. And he's going to look around, and we're going to come up from behind, giggity, and we're going to hold B. Nom! Beautiful. Ah, so it was a map showing where the guards are positioned. So we're actually going to use it this time around instead of just going, oh yes, yeah, get off my roof, bitch. Okay, I'm feeling that we should go for... Uh, let's go for the, uh, the, uh, what's it called? The helping out fellow assassins one. The one with the two eyes on it. God damn it. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Or we could go for the flag hunt one. Ah, uh, choices. They're both, like, so hard. Far out. Um, whichever one comes first, I think. Oh, God, it's the flag hunt. Hey boy. Is this the great Altair before me? What an honor. You must be here for a very important mission. Maybe I could help you. I have been eavesdropping and I have learned much. However, I have erred. I had some Masiyeth flags to deliver to the bureau leader, but I lost them when attacked by thugs. Could you find them for me? I must be back to my mentor before he returns from the market, so you must be fast as the wind. Alright, let's go, boy. Which way are we going? We're going this way. Alright. I hate these so much. Because ah. you literally have to touch them. I mean, it's it's probably more realistic that way, but it's just annoying. Because there's no, like, there's no box around them that you can walk into. So, you don't, you know, you, you can't just be close. You have to actually walk into the fucking things. Which is annoying. And they're all over the place as well. Shit, shit, shit. Alright, go, boy. Nice. Nice. Good work. 
Good work, son. I'll only throw more. Two. Did I get that? I did. Come on, boy. Come on. One. Oh, you... Oh. oh, fuck it. Just drop, boy. Nice. La 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 la. I'm back! Great. I knew I could count on you, Master Altair. Here is what I learned from listening to the guards near the Dome of the Rock. They were talking about the man named Talal. They said he has many loyal followers, all of whom will readily give their lives for the man. Their master is in danger. They are sure to intervene, giving Talal time to escape. That is all I know. I hope my small contribution will help. Alrighty, so the guards are very loyal. Um, what am I doing? So that means that we can't just make them run away by scaring them, by killing too many of them. Because they'll just, they just stay. They'll stay and fight. And they'll try and protect their master at all costs. Which is not good. Altair, it seems I've made some enemies. Al Mualem asked that I shadow the slave trader. And I did. Though not well enough. He discovered me and I've been running from his men ever since. I need to get out of the city. But I can't do it alone. Help me. And I'll share what I've learned with you. Brilliant. Another escort mission. Just what I wanted. You look familiar. You look like a fuckwit. Damn right. That was probably very racist. You touch him, and I'll fuck your women. Come on. Eh, eh, eh. Shit. Hey, there we go. Stab. What doots? Doots. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Oh, I did it too early. Oh, and now I'm missing him. Hey, there we go. Stab. Come here, you bitch. Hey, there we go. Hey, boy, get up. <laughs> I like how he's just so calm about it. He's just like, yeah, cool. He's not dead yet. There we go. That's better. That's better. Okay. Where are we going? Are we going this way? Alright. Uh, I think we're gonna go... Are you... Fuck off. Hey! Eh, eh, there we go. You too. Your turn. Eh. 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 There we go. There we go. Yeah, time to run. Oh. It's okay, it's okay. Alright, nearly there. Nearly there. Ah, shit. Come on, come on. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. Good work. Come on, keep going. You got this. Come on. Come on. Something to say. Come on. Yeah, you're fucking ugly. There we go. Thank you, brother. Take this map. It lists Talal's hiding places. Useful information should that coward choose to run instead of fight. And from what I know of the man, run is what he'll do. Ah, okay. So, if he does run from us, which, uh, yeah, he probably will, um... We have a map of his hiding spaces, so we can go and find him if we lose him. Anyway, the ones you love. Work hard, and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. Who knows what the future holds? What tragedies tomorrow may bring? Defend against an uncertain future. Protect the ones you love. Work hard, and you will be rewarded. Talal provides. All right. So another preacher. Saying really off things. Very edited, and very false. It's a lot like today's media, isn't it? <laughs> okay. Ow. Piss off. Hey, what the fuck? Ev every time. Boom. Yeah, there we go. I have no 
nothing to say to you. Speak to me or speak to God. It's your choice. You won't stop the work he does. Cannot stop it. Stop what? What work? He prepares them for the journey. Journey where? They are held in his warehouse. And when the time comes, they are sent to Akka. Where is this warehouse? And why Akka? Talal tells me what I need to know. Nothing more. It is safer that way. For him, perhaps. Though not, I fear, for you. Okay, so something about a warehouse. Let me read. What was it? Ah! Slaves, that's right. He's a slave trader, I believe. Ah, that's right. That's bringing back memories. Okay. I'm feeling the eavesdrop. Let's do the eavesdrop. That one's easy. It's a nice change of pace. La 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 la. Oh, also, I'll show you tackle, because I only just got that. Boom! There you go. You don't run as fast, but, uh, yeah, may as well. You don't run as fast, but you don't get knocked over. It's pretty useful. Safety and peace, Altair. We live in harsh times, do we not? I am in an ocean of trouble. I had a mission to investigate some strange disappearances in the rich district, and Talal's men saw my face. My status is compromised. Would you be kind enough to eliminate them for me in exchange for the information you seek? Alright, so we have two targets. Okay, so we're gonna get the fuck out of my way, son. Oh! 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 I am so sorry! I am so sorry! <laughs> Look at it! <laughs> oh man! I'm so sorry, man. I didn't mean for that to happen. Oh, shit. Oh, well. YOLO. Alright, so where are our targets? Um, ah, they're on the ground. Oh, they're in the market. Oh, okay. So... Oh, I was going to eagle, eagle jump, but whatevs. Um, uh, there's no door here. Oh, yeah, there is. Alright, so where are our targets? Oh, that's him there. Well, this is going to be a bit hard. Because there's guards everywhere. Get out of my face! Get the... Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna kill a bitch. Boom. Alright, so there we go. One down. One to go. We gotta pick our times wisely. So there he is. Over there, I believe. I think. No, he's gone around the corner. Oh, there he is. Hey, boy. It's time to die, bitch. So basically, this guy's standing still. So we can come around here, watch for guards, and we can go stabby stabby, and then we can piss off. So we're gonna go this way, and or we'll watch the guard. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna run, 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 run. And we're going to try and get back on the ground as well, because I don't want to get caught up here. Yeah, I thought archers in this game were a pain in the ass, but you don't know pain in the ass until you've played Assassin's Creed 4 and there's sharpshooters everywhere. God, that is painful. Like, seriously? Anyway. Altair, you're rid of the ones who knew me? Excellent. Here's what I learned about Talal. He's a powerful slaver who occupies an area north of town near the Barbican. He pays a tribute to the city guards so he can operate in the shadows. But from what you showed me today, I'm sure he will share the same fate as the others. Thank you again, Altair. Alright, one more to go, and it is an eavesdrop mission. Lovely change of pace. Okay. Sir, so, we're going to climb up here. Oh, also, I believe uh, the next assassination, which is in the next memory block, I will be able to uh, fast travel. So that's quite helpful. So I don't have to cut out me riding everywhere. 
which is very nice. Enjoy that a lot. Ah, don't you? D oh shit! Oops! Hey boys! Nice. Um, so where are they? Where are they? Um. Oh, they're in the church itself. Ah, okay. La 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 la. La 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 la. La la la. Fuck me, dead. Ah, uh, they're not gonna let me in, are they? Is there an entrance point through the roof? What is it? Is that an entrance point? Your presence annoys me. Your presence makes me sick. Um. All right, how to get up? Oh shit! This is an Assassin's Creed 2. Rip a derp. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa! Ah! Oh, I'm stuck. Oh no. Oh no. You're kidding. You're kidding me. No! Fuck you. Fuck you, eavesdrop mission. You broke it. Fucking hell. Alright, I'm gonna get myself killed. Kill me! Kill me! Do it! Oh man, what just happened? Please do it! Yeah, there we go. Oh man, what was that? That was pathetic. When you are exposed, tackle people who are That's better. Alright. So we're gonna have to go through that again. God, that was annoying. Alright, I'll see you back at the church. Okay, and we are back here, and this bitch just walked straight into me. I'm thinking we're gonna have to go in and kill these people. They're not gonna let me in. Fuck you! Don't you dare touch me! Piece of shit. Alright, let's take it out here, boys. Boom. Oh. Ha! <laughs> that was brilliant. Stabby, stabby. Stabby, stabby. Yeah, fuck off. Alright. It looks like they're still there. That's good. What the fuck is happening? All right. He's a coward. If it wasn't for the money, I'd be long gone. You're either stupid or blind. Maybe it's both. How can you say that? You didn't see what happened. I saw well enough. Our caravan was attacked, and the first thing he did was flee. No, he didn't run. What are you talking about? Do you forget what became of the men who attacked us? Filled by our archers, thanks be to God. Not our archers, him, alone. So you're saying he saved us? Yes, he headed for higher ground. And used his bow to kill them. I... I have no idea. The man's a master archer. You do well to remember that. Okay, so this dude is an archer. Alrighty, that was our last thingo. Jesus, that was eventful. Alright, back to the bureau it is. That was stupid. That was very stupid. Get out my face. I'm sorry. Oh, I wonder where he went. It's definitely not the dude in a white cloak with weapons all over him. Silly bastards. Alright, we are so close. We are so close. What are you doing? You fucking imprint. That's better. That's what I want. Climb up the ladder. Alright. We are nearly there. Come on. 
Jesus, come on. Alright. And we are here. Drop in. Drop. You fucking idiot. It's supposed to be epic. Here we are. Malik. Come to waste more of my time? I found Talal. I'm ready to begin my mission. That is for me to decide. Very well. Here's what I know. He traffics in human lives, kidnapping Jerusalem citizens and selling them into slavery. His base is a warehouse located inside the Barbican, north of here. As we speak, he prepares a caravan for travel. I'll strike while he's inspecting his stock. If I can avoid his men, Talal himself should prove little challenge. Little challenge? Listen to you. Such arrogance. Are we finished? Are you satisfied with what I've learned? No. But it will have to do. Rest, prepare, cry in the corner. Do whatever it is you do before a mission. Only make sure you do it quietly. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Okay, it's time to strike, and as always, that is the end of this episode. So thank you very much for watching this episode. If you liked it, give it a like. If you want to see more of these videos, the best way to do it is to subscribe. I've also got a series playlist that I have linked in the description below. So you can click on that and it'll have every single Assassin's Creed series video playthrough episode I do. I'm also very active on Twitter nowadays, so if you'd like to follow me on Twitter, I will be posting updates regularly. And as always, if you have any constructive criticism whatsoever, definitely leave a comment or private message me, and I'll be sure to take it on board. So once again, thank you very much for watching this video. My name is General Mittens, and I'll see you in the next episode.